Okay. And you see this guy. He's not real! <laughs> so I signed the four of you up for the fight club. I'm ready. Someone in your group has a bunch of knowledge with these creatures that you are fighting I wonder in the who. fight club. I wonder who it is. Please show yourselves from the shadows. Hello, it is I. Um... I, uh... <laughs> it was me. <laughs> it's, it's him. He's the one that knows it all. Oh, it's, it's I. Even me, the host, don't know anything about these creatures. Slight knowledge based on video games, oh. but that is it. All right. Oh. What creatures do we have here? Oh, they're oh. dinosaurs. It's Jurassic. What? Oh, okay. Okay, oh, yeah. I, I feel like I'm not that dumb, but just to be sure, Patrick, they're not alive anymore, <laughs> right? <laughs> well, uh, it depends what you would define fine as a dinosaur because oh. there are still dinosaurs alive today. Okay. It's just not the ones that people normally think of. Now we would call dinosaurs birds. So oh, dinosaurs, aka the Republican Party. <laughs> so, you guys, <laughs> so you guys are fighting these birds, yes? It's not that all dinosaurs are birds. It's that all birds are dinosaurs. So these mm. that we have here depicted are not birds. Ranking these not birds <laughs> into which one can you guys take on in a fight? It's probably going to be none of them, to be honest. <laughs> all right, Dad, let me take on the big one. Let me take the big one on. This one? I believe that is Allosaurus, one of the most common oh. predators of the Jurassic era. You about to be sore. You about to be I sore. I mean, you guys <laughs> can work together to fight this creature. Can you... We're uh... fighting him? Patrick, what are we, what are his weaknesses? That's a great question. Um, <laughs> not uh, not a ton. Meteors. <laughs> this is a fairly powerful creature. Yes! The Ice Age. <laughs> Look, you don't ride an elevator for the music or pick an airline for the movies. So when it comes to audio entertainment, it makes sense to choose Audible. It's the home for stories told by the biggest stars like Ethan Hawke, Kerry Washington, Kevin Hart. It's home to epic adventures, chilling mysteries, and can't miss comedies. Audible is the home of storytelling. Let your imagination soar with audiobooks, podcasts, and originals. And you know something I love personally about Audible? No matter where I am, my imagination can run wild. Like with the lives of celebrities, the journey to your best self, the spider web of true crimes. I know a lot of y'all are into that. There's always so much to explore and discover. Like I've said this before, but I like improving me. So I've listened a lot to Atomic Habits because I want to make a habit of like living like a normal person. And that is the biggest my imagination can go sometimes. Find the best of what you love or something new to discover. Audible has an incredible selection of audiobooks across every genre from bestsellers and new releases to celebrity memoirs mysteries and thrillers motivation wellness business and more and as an audible member you can choose one title a month to keep from their entire catalog including the latest bestsellers and new releases members also get full access to a growing selection of included audiobooks audible originals and podcasts you can download and stream their included titles all you want and now you can even listen to recreo on audible yeah that's right how cool is that all of your favorite content on one app. So let Audible help you discover new ways to laugh, be inspired, or be entertained. New members can try it for free for 30 days. Visit audible.com slash recreo or text recreo to 500-500. Audible.com slash recreo or text recreo to 500-500 to try Audible free for 30 days. Audible.com slash recreo. Thank you Audible for sponsoring us. And now back to the video. So how does this tier list work? Are we are we putting them in terms of how dangerous well, they are? Well, how the more we we're to... going into this, the more I'm realizing you can't uh, survive fighting them. So which one will you be more likely to survive? <laughs> a couple of these are like two, three feet tall, right? Yeah, that's what, I'm, what I was going to get to. Some of these I recognize as being rather small creatures. Oh, um, okay. Is this one big, Patrick? Do you know off how the top of your head? One? That would be a, quite a large dinosaur. Chucking five feet or what? Allosaurus <laughs> is the apex about? predator of the giraffe. Era. Um, oh, so. I, don't, I don't like that. You know what? I look at him and go, it's a new era, baby. <laughs> I don't Run even. I'm not fighting Apex anything, bro. I'm not even at the I'm, Apex in my life. I'm not trying to end <laughs> this fast. There are fossils of like the largest herbivores. Like they have Allosaurus bites on them. So this would have oh. been what ate those. That's what uh, you, that's what you uh, have. Uh, I put 
Keep that boy in the S tier. Put him away lot. from me. Put him in the F tier for fossil. This guy just looks like a worm in this picture. That guy's from the land before time. I could take him, bro. That's Littlefoot. That's yeah, little little his dad, bro. Yeah, bro. Oh, no. I'm getting. He got a lot of neck to choke out. Brachiosaurus was one of the largest uh, land animals of all time. That I would say like if to beat a lot of these dinosaurs, it would be tripping them because there'd be a lot a of like, I've fallen and I can't get up kind of thing. Ooh, it's like the AT-ATs from Star Wars where the things spun around and <laughs> go legs. around them. Sure, but guys, yeah. they don't wear shoes. How are we going to tie their shoelaces? Uh, 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 the down, 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 down. Patrick, observation, <laughs> Patrick, what are the logistics of guys. me tying its neck like a Looney Tunes bow? Like, is that humanly possible or are there... <laughs> I don't know that much about its uh, biology, but maybe you could, you know, strangle it or something. I think it's C or D because yeah, I mean, like, C -tier. herbivore. What about her? C. Wait, Dan. What about that dinosaur with the white square background? That one looked crazy. It probably kind of small, but that thing's probably no. tiny. What? Oh okay. yeah. What is that's that's Dilophosaurus. That's how it was depicted in the first Jurassic Park movie. Bible. Um, oh wow. Also, yes, the Bible. <laughs> um, Did you see the Bible. <laughs> it was actually larger than they showed it in the movie. How tall are they? Kurt 62 talked about how tall are they? Though? How tall are they? Though? How tall are they? Though? I bet his reach ain't like mine. I, I don't know how tall it is. At least six feet tall. Probably like 10 At feet tall. At least six feet? Whoa. Oh, that's a threat. Put him yeah, in the B tier, tall, bro. Corner. He's <laughs> coming after. Uh, that guy on the top left with all fours. What's that one called? That's a cool looking okay. one. Okay. Oh, I've seen that one. That's, I used to have that's that one Ankylosaurus. Too. My only Kyle? knowledge of this is Ark and they break rocks. Yo, if he's breaking rocks, put him in the S tier, bro. We're fine. Yeah. Well, the thing with this one is that it's it's heavily armored on its backside and so a lot of times in like movies or whatever they'll they'll show that it has like a weak underbelly yeah we'll make it go to sleep with Cute a belly rub belly and then rub. christian will probably say great distraction so if we Smash could knock it rubs. over onto its back maybe we have a chance ow wait put that in d tier then that's just a big turtle put that guy in d tier next next opponent next opponent dad next opponent this is pachycephalosaurus it has a very compact bony skull that it used to oh, like, cephalo headbutt uh <laughs> things kind of like a like I've a big horn sheep just like you very oonga boonga. What the hell? <laughs> is it an herbivore, Patrick? It is an herbivore, yeah. Yeah, it's got, okay, it's so got a beak. He's got a beak? That's kind of nice. I think he does. He's got a beak. So does like Triceratops and them too. A lot of them have beaks. Oh my god, oh, they do have beaks. That's interesting. All these birds! <laughs> <laughs> you can't fight birds? Put them in the E tier. I ain't losing no beak. Yeah, nah. <laughs> I ain't losing to nobody running straight, bro. What if I, I move left? Him. I'm not losing to no pigeon, bro. E? Nah, I ain't losing no e goddamn tier. bird. He got to run straight to get me E tier, bro. Oh next opponent. Next opponent. He's cute. Oh, oh man. I'm, no, no. Put that in F tier. I'm stepping what do you, on it. What do you mean? What do you nah, mean? I'm stepping on mean? it. I'm stepping on it. Of all the dinosaurs on this list, I think this is probably the one that you are in the least stepping danger on. of. You heard of Patrick said easy <laughs> flat F tier. <laughs> it's just because it's so small. I believe this one is called Compsognathus. I think it was like like chicken size, basically. Oh, Maybe a little bit. Easy vermin. Oh. Easy oh. death. Look at him. We I'm cooking them too. Which one do you guys want to fight? Now nah, you one? pick, then. Send them in. Send them in. We're ready. What's the... uh, is that a duck? What is, that is a that? What the hell is that? <laughs> it's some some kind of hadrosaur. Yeah, there was a lot of dinosaurs. They look like that a loafer, looked like bro. they had the duck bills. There's a few of them on this on this tier list I see. I look like a duck. loafer. Burn! It's Daffy Duck. Now, all the other dinosaurs bully this one. Put them in D tier. Moving forward, these cute little boys. How the oh, hell no? So this is called Velociraptor. And, well, it depends on if we're talking about the movie version of Velociraptor or if we're talking about... The real ones were, like, way smaller, right? Yeah. yeah. There, there were, like, raptor dinosaurs that were that size. But Velociraptor uh -huh. specifically was a lot smaller. Probably the size of, like, a mm -hmm. turkey. Oh, oh dude, they're clapping here. Clapping here. <laughs> Thanksgiving came early, dog. Put that in the F tier, dog. I would, I could fight a turkey. I would hit the pad. I don't want to do this, but I wait. Then, right. then yes. send me in that, uh, send me in that water one right quick at the top right. Top right. Oh, oh what no. is this? Okay. Dude, that's a Final this Fantasy dude, boss. Put that dude, in S. Tuna. If it was like in the water and I'm standing on land, I'm like, I'll wait for you to evolve, dog. I'll be here. <laughs> it's a Pokemon, bro. <laughs> Well, that? the funny thing is, if you want to know what it's, wait for it to evolve, uh, you're going to end up fighting a Komodo dragon because oh, that's what's wait, uh, that's, that's that's the closest right, living relative ooh. today. Nah, but how how dangerous is he if I stand on the shore? Put him in the F tier. That's what I'm saying. Put him in the F tier. Put him in the F tier, bro. I mean, T Rex. Go ahead, just put him in the S. Just put him in the S. Put him in the S. Patrick, how big was the T Rex? 
Was he was he actually an apex predator? Yeah. The T-Rex. Oh, Absolutely. it was. Would the T-Rex beat um the other S tier out of curiosity? Yes, <laughs> definitely. Yeah. Oh, T-Rex wow. was way bigger than Allosaurus. Allosaurus is still bigger than any predator we could really uh, deal with today. My favorite apex predator is the United States military industrial. <laughs> oh my god. Put that out there in the S plus. Next. <laughs> Next. Anyways, this guy scares me in art. But what so. did dinosaur know about a defense budget, bro? That's Arc. Spinosaurus. Um, Spinosaurus. It, uh, I wonder why. How did he? <laughs> With these names. <laughs> they look around the room. They were like, yo, Spinosaurus? Spinosaurus? Yeah. They go zoom in the water. Yo, yeah. What is this? Okay, what that's, is, is that from Avatar? Uh, from what I could tell, yeah. that's supposed to be Parasaurolophus, which is just like the, it's another one of those duck bill dinosaurs. Oh, it's a duck? Yeah. Ah, yeah. uh, it's a duck. I <laughs> <don't> <laughs> no Put the it's duck with the other ducks, bro. Get them out of here. <laughs> the thing about these duck bill dinosaurs, they're, they're pretty good runners. Oh, they better be. So, uh... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> what about the duck deer? What about the duck deer, duck? Next. <laughs> what about this one? It's the Ivan sword. Okay. What is that? What is it? What is it? Is it another I, type of small? Not super small. It's kind of like an ostrich. I think it's, I think that one's called Gallimimus. Um, and uh, yeah, oh. it's basically an ostrich of sorts. I'm not e fighting an ostrich. Tier. That's Goodbye. what I'm saying. It's like, okay, you, you're you're afraid of the ostrich, but you're not afraid of the duck dinosaur. Saying. That's like yes, five times. That is, no, that is exactly <laughs> correct. And there's all that. these massive. <laughs> Some creatures and I'm a Christian walking up to him like I am losing a no duck. Dude, the big duck is still a duck. I'm winning that fight. Uh, Keep him in the duck tier. What, what about this flying one? That is pterodactyl. A, oh, oh yeah, bro, pterodactyl. he ain't handling that. Put him in the S tier. He got the higher ground, Anakin. Put him on the S tier. So I'm gonna guess that this one is also flying up. Is that to a bird? Us. What no, is that? that Here's the difference. They got a duck bill. They're like, <laughs> <laughs> wait, hold on. I gotta get close. <laughs> Trying to see if he got. Well, a Duck Bill. Look at uh, the bottom roll, the bottom that guy. This one? Triceratops? Yeah. Triceratops. That Triceratops. Yeah. Bro, that's a Power Ranger right there. I mean, it's either A or S in my opinion, to be honest. Like, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. They can run over a car and not even care. Wait, can we, Den, is there any more ducks? I need to get my <laughs> confidence. I, gotta, more, yeah. I need, I need a tune up, bro. You got a few duplicates. Den, put the, all the ducks in the D tier, Wait, Den. Are all these? Of them. Are all we really of them. moving them? Yes, move the premium ducks down there, too, dog. The premium the ducks. This one. Basically very similar to Triceratops. Maybe a little smaller uh, with a little... Uh, smaller? With... That's Big Shield Gardner from Yu-Gi-Oh. Big I mean, Shield Gardner. <laughs> <laughs> got like. 2,600 defense points. Yeah, oh, exactly. Man. As a four-star monster, that's BS. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Thanks. hey. Who's uh, next? What about... What is this guy? Is this what is that? I, I can't really tell what that one is. But something pretty similar to Dilophosaurus, which is the one that you already have in B. He I stays B. there. Okay. He took we the weirdest speed run one. this. Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus, the legend. Y'all know what's at the end of its tail, right? Is Bunch that spikes? of spikes. Yeah. Who's that big headed guy right there with the horns? Oh, is that a uh, cranny dose? Yeah, basically, yeah. Can you go back to the one that headbutts things? Did anybody else notice the massive receding hairline? <laughs> <laughs> yo, <laughs> yo, I <laughs> noticed that. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> Boy, I don't know what area you from, but your hairline prehistoric. <laughs> 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 Put him in the tier. <laughs> no, they could headbutt you and kill you. No, bro, I don't care about that hairline, bro. <laughs> nah, just for the hairline alone, F tier. <laughs> oh my god, no. All right, this All right. guy, I'm pretty sure. Uh, uh, he looks crazy. You. What is that? That oh is god. Ceratosaurus. Uh, it had razor sharp shit. teeth that were serrated, hence Ceratosaurus. That's what the name oh, is for. Uh, it also had a little horn on its head or on its nose. Watch out! <laughs> He's <laughs> He's fighting down on Christian and Christian goes, dude, watch out for that horn. <laughs> I'm getting my body torn in shreds. I'm like, guys, careful, the horn. The horn's right, man. Yeah, I think it's an S on so, both. One's just stronger. I mean, because yeah. I feel like he'd tear apart yeah, anyone in Yeah, but the horn, egg. Kurt. What about yeah, the, the horn, though? Yeah, yeah watch out. The, the watch horn out. makes it all the way up front. <laughs> watch out. This last one you have is uh, Indominus is Rex from Jurassic World. Dominus Rex? In Indominus Rex from Jurassic World 1. How does this look on survivability? I still think it's a bit optimistic, I will say, but... You know. <laughs> <laughs> 
Patrick is right. Patrick, what are you, an expert? We're just making fun of Patrick. I'm definitely not an expert. I don't have to be an expert to tell you that we're going to die. That's for sure. <laughs> Patrick, which one of these would make the most optimized dino nugget? I'm, I'm partial to the Stegosaurus. The Stegosaurus has those fun little spikes. Perfect for dipping oh, into, yeah. the, into the sauce, you know? True. It seems like you guys aren't surviving most of these outside of probably... Bro, look at all these flying ones. Like, oh, it's just a bunch of angry <laughs> I lose it to no bird. <laughs> and with that, you guys find out that Brad Pitt was all a pigment of your imagination. A and you guys, uh. You call him a pigment then? A pigment no. Of, what? A pigment you call him a pigment of my imagination. That's crazy. Oh, right, but we can't find these dinosaurs. But Patrick, where can we find you, though? Oh, yes, nice. sir. You can find me at youtube.com slash tier zoo. If you want to learn about wildlife ecology and evolutionary biology through the lens of gaming, that's, that's oh. where you can go. I do want to do, do that. Like, I love that. Do you like Monster Hunter? I've actually never played Monster Hunter, but I love a lot of video Bro, games. Bro, you got to play Monster Sorry. Hunter. Sorry. <laughs> I know. I've heard good things for sure. Thank you for making us just a little bit smarter. Yeah, yeah. I, I ain't losing no goddamn duck. That's what I learned. <laughs> losing no duck. Oh my God. Can we get an outro? Recreo out. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> I ain't losing it, no duck. And on the S plus 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 tier are patrons. Thank you so much to Rena Mew, Calvin Duong, Puggerbelly, Matthew Hennis, Barzanator, and Drew Arnis. Okay, bye.